Hello, welcome to another episode of Out of Bounds. I'm Shannon Shepard, and today I'm with junior forward Demetrius Conger. Now, Demetrius, you're from Brooklyn, New York. How'd you get your start playing hoops? Um, I got my start by going to the park with my mom and just shooting around and started coming to the park with my own, so. And then you played a little bit in elementary school, you told me, and then how'd you end up going from high school basketball to Division I basketball? Um, I went, kept going from Brooklyn to Georgia, and then finally when I stayed in Georgia, you know, started playing on the varsity team, moved up to the prep team, and my senior year, St. Bonaventure came to see one of my games and told me to come around to visit. The rest so. is history. Yeah. Um, what attracted you to St. Bonaventure? Because you said you're from the city, you've been to the south. What, what brought you out here to western New York? Um, I think it was, I think it was the fact that it was, it's not too close to home, but it's not too far. And it's like more of a, like a small community, you know, so. Now you're a business management major. Why'd you pick the business major at St. Bonaventure? Um, honestly, because it's probably the only program I really like, you know, out of all of the ones that they offer, so. You played overseas a little bit this off season. You traveled to a couple of different countries. Uh, tell us a little bit more about that. Where'd you get to play? Um, I got to play in Belgium, Germany, and we went to go visit London, but we didn't play in London. But it was overall a good experience. experience. Now you've been able to explode offensively this season, recording a career high 27 points against Niagara. What's been the difference for you this season? Um, I think the difference has been, you know, being aggressive and I mean with, you know, Andrew getting a lot of attention, you know, on the scout and everything, you know, it makes it easier for, you know, me, Eric and everybody else, you know, to score. So. Next season, the Atlantic 10 Championship is moving to Brooklyn. Are you excited to play some basketball in your backyard? Yeah, very excited, very excited. Were you able to have family and friends be able to come out and watch, you think? Yeah, I think I have a, a, a big turnout. <laughs> a <laughs> very big fan section? Yeah. That's awesome. All right, now in all these episodes of Out of Bounds, I do a quick 10 in which I'm going to ask you 10 quest quick questions. Just tell me the first thing that comes to your mind, okay? Okay. All right, first, do you have any pregame rituals? Oh, take a shower before a game. Every game? Every game. Even on the road? Even on the road. <laughs> uh, you usually have headphones on during shoot around before games. What are you listening to? Um, mainly, mainly rap. Maybe some R and B here and there, but mainly rap. <laughs> You're one of the few players to wear a mouth guard during games. Why is that? Oh, for braces. All right. Braces. You're six foot six right now. You're a foot taller than me. Do you think you're done growing? Nah, I think I have like, like four more inches. Four more inches. Four more inches. Whoa. <laughs> Um, now I've asked all the other guys this. What do you think of the Wolf Pack, that crazy student section here in the Riley Center? Um, I think the Wolf Pack, I think the Wolf Pack is like real great. You know, it makes the, the Riley Center what it is, so. What's your favorite dunk you've ever done? Favorite dunk I ever did was my junior year high school when I threw it off the backboard in the game. Whoa. Yeah. Is favorite. that on tape anywhere? Uh, yeah. We should try to find that. That's sick. Yeah, I did it twice. Whoa! <laughs> uh, what's your favorite breakfast cereal? Favorite breakfast cereal? Uh, Captain Crunch Berries. Sometimes they have that in the hickey. Yeah. I'm a big fan. I love Captain Crunch, too. Uh, you went to high school in Georgia. I'm from Virginia. What's one thing you miss most about the South? The food. Me, too. The food. The food and the weather, too. Oh, yeah. Not as so much snow as this. The food more, though. <laughs> Now your buddy, Mike Davenport, I was talking to him a little bit before this interview. He said you're quite the singer. What's that all about? Um, I sing in the locker room, you know. You know they, they keep telling me to sing more, but you know, I tell them I gotta practice and stuff, so. <laughs> What's your favorite song to sing? Favorite song to sing? Yeah. Uh, I don't know, right now it probably is Frank Ocean, Nova Cane. No, I know that song. Yeah. Um, what do you think about the Birdman nickname, finally? A lot of people, the fans, they call you that. Um, I think I think it's a good name, you know. My high school coach gave it to me when I first got to Georgia, so I mean, you know, every time I hear it, you know, it makes me think of Georgia, so. Good. Birdman. Yeah. All right. Thanks so much for going Out of Bounds with us. Make sure you stay tuned to GoBonnies.com for many more episodes of Out of Bounds.